Hi there, Paul here from Charity Hub. In this video, I want to show you how you can reduce manual effort and simplify your gift aid claim processes with Charity Hub. As we're using Charity Hub on a day-to-day -day basis to record our income, Charity Hub is automatically recording in the background where gift aid can be claimed. And in fact, I can easily navigate into the transactions area and see a complete list of all the gift aid that we can claim or has already been claimed. Now, previously, without Charity Hub, I might have had spreadsheets that had to be manually edited and maintained to put together our claim to HMRC. Well, with Charity Hub's HMRC integration, I can create and submit my claim with just a few clicks. To do this, I navigate to the Gift Aid Claims area and click New. The first thing I need to do here is enter a name for this claim. So let's call this October 22. The next thing I need to do is choose a claim start date and a claim end date. So let's go from the 1st of September through to today. Once I've got that information in there, I can save this claim. Once I've created and saved the claim, I can then start to add my gift aid transactions. To do this, I simply click the Get Transactions button at the top and the system will find all the gift aid transactions that occurred between the specified dates that either haven't been claimed or aren't already part of a claim. Now we can see all of the transactions that are on this particular claim. I can also see the number of transactions that make up this claim and the total value that we are going to be claiming. If I wanted to remove one or more transactions from this claim for whatever reason, I can tick the transactions and click Remove Transactions. And you can see they have now been removed and the number of transactions and the total value has been updated. If I want to preview my claim to see the date that's going to be submitted to HMRC, or maybe even I want to submit this to HMRC manually, I can click the Preview button at the top here. This gives me a spreadsheet that I could use to review what will be sent to HMRC, or I could copy and paste this data directly into the HMRC template for manual submission. But we don't want to do that, we don't want to do it manually, we just want to click a button and submit this directly to HMRC. So the first thing I need to do is approve this claim. By approving the claim, that lets us build in an approval step so that somebody else can verify the claim before it goes out. Now this is actually a great point where you could extend Charity Hub yourself using Power Automate to implement your own approval processes if you so wish. As it comes out of the box though, all I have to do is put a Charity Hub user into this box, so let's go with Paul, and then save the record. Now that I've approved the claim, you'll see that the status of the claim has changed to approved. You'll also notice I've got a new button at the top here, Submit to HMRC. So now that I'm happy with this claim, let's click Submit to HMRC. At this point, the system asks me if I want to do an online submission or if I'm going to be doing the actual submission manually outside of Charity Hub. In this instance, I'm going to choose Online Submission and click Submit. At this point, the claim then goes into a state of submitting to HMRC, as you can see at the top here. When we submit gift aid claims to HMRC, quite a lot of validation is done by HMRC on their side. So we don't get an immediate acceptance back for the claim. It can take a little while. But don't worry, Charity Hub will keep checking the status of the claim in the background and update the claim appropriately once HMRC have done what they need to do. Once HMRC have acknowledged that the submission has been successfully validated and received, Charity Hub will update the status of the claim to Submission Successful. At this point, you'll notice a new button at the top to complete the claim. When I click this button, Charity Hub will update all the associated gift aid transactions on the claim to a paid status and mark the claim itself as complete. This signifies that we've had our payment from HMRC and we can now recognize the income from the gift aid as paid in Charity Hub. It's entirely up to you at what point in your process you mark this claim as complete. Once this claim is complete, you'll see the whole record becomes read-only and I can no longer make any changes to that for auditing purposes. This gives me complete visibility of every single claim and the transactions I claimed for directly within Charity Hub. Thanks for watching and I hope that's given you a good overview of how easy it is to put your gift aid claims together and submit them to HMRC. If you do have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to us.